Hello viewers, I am here with XT4. Yeah. And later on today, I probably will be doing the mixture of XT4. It just might not be uploaded at the same time. I'm going to make sure of XT4 next, but they just won't be uploaded at the same time. Now, I thought this character would be a lot bigger than he actually is. To get a representative, let's bring in next. And they're about the same size. And that's one reason it's because he's going to crouch down. Let's get him up more. He's no longer that crouched crouch down. So I really don't get it. He's a small old guy, but he uses those two pin pieces down here. Now one thing I've noticed through these two, which I did not mention in the next video, is they're using these light gray pieces a lot. Like those are his only upper those are only type bones right there. I think it would have looked a lot better if they made outer bones right there. But what are you gonna do? Now, I've mentioned in the past that I thought XT4 was going to be a helper for the heroes. And there's a reason for that. The prototype pictures, or not pictures, but when they original, when they first released, like, these are going to be the things. When they showed XT4, he had no pipes, so I'm not going to actually take out the pipes. And he had a hero core right there. That's what XT4 looked like without the pipes in the pictures. I don't know why, but that's why I thought he was going to be a helper. And when I actually saw an official XT4 out the Hero Core, I was like, oh man, I was wrong. And now I finally get to prove people I'm sorry. Take that out. Put these things back in. And one thing is, I think the only reason they even included these pipes was to put something on his stomach. Because they really kind of make him look a lot stupider. And also, I think it would have been a lot better, I'm not going to actually do this, but if they took off this, put it on the top arms, and put this on one of his extra arm pieces. Because, like, laser and saw on the extra part, and then two spikes on the actual arm parts. Even though he uses these two as actual arms. And these things, even in the pictures, these are all sticking up. And it's kind of hard to mimic his drilling on, or spike hitting on the bottom. Because it's just not that small, far down. I think this should have made a better head sculpt for this guy. Since it connects from there. You could have gotten rid of this bottom. Turned that around. So it could have actually looked up and down a little more other than having that cat attach that thing just to make him be able to do that it is a pretty good figure he has sculpting on weird teeth probably can't see it and he's real good at being an unhumanoid creature which from other people think is I think it's kind of annoying like oh they need to make un they need to make creatures that are unhumanoid. Well, I don't care. No one really cares if they're unhumanoid or humanoid. Like, I at least don't. I just want them to get out more sets so I can get more things. Uh, that was a burp. Okay. Now I'll get on to the laser. The laser using a Lego City drill, drill saw piece. And... Oh, they both got lasers. They must be fighting each other because they both got lasers. Stupid. But it is pretty good because it looks like when he does this, there is no laser. It's just nothing. Like, he clamps, supposed to clamp them together. And oh, there's no laser. He doesn't shoot a laser like that. And once he opens them up, just enough a laser's on it and it starts firing. And it shoots like and then he opens it a lot and there'd be a huge laser coming out. And the more he opens it, the bigger the laser would get. That's how I picture his weapon. He has these two just random spiking arms up here. And then he has this drill what spills fits freely on its own. Until when I first put on the this thing, 
it kind of got stuck by that. When you know, I first put it on, had his arm up. When I put it over the arm, it would hit that. It would hit this when I had this over the arm plugged in, like the direction said. And that was just annoying. But, pretty good. He has the Ben 10 feet, and the only armor pieces he gets on the actual armor piece spot are on the bottom of his legs. Eh. I would say this is a pretty good set. For a pretty good Hero Factory. And a pretty good guy to fight. Pretty good guy. And yes, the combiner will be coming up soon. Stay around, stick around for the combiner. See you later, guys. And yes, I can see you, because I'm right behind you. Subscriber shoots you in the back.